As you step onto the Trans-Siberian Railway, you are embarking on the adventure of a lifetime. Over the course of seven days, the journey across eight time zones will lead you over 3,901 bridges, weaving through Russia's diverse landscapes. Your senses tingle as you settle into your seat. The Trans-Siberian Railway connects the Pacific port of Vladivostok to the capital of Moscow, passing through some of Russia's major cities. Tsar Alexander III ordered the construction of this massive rail system in 1891, and his son Tsar Nicholas II completed it in 1916. It took over 70,000 people to build, making it one of the greatest engineering feats of all time in the world. The train travels through a variety of landscapes, from Siberian forests to the rugged Ural Mountains. The scenery outside the train window will be breathtaking as you move along. Sleeping on the train is an essential part of the Trans-Siberian Railway experience. Particularly on longer journeys of up to seven days, passengers have the opportunity to sleep first class, second class, or third class. The most luxurious cabins are first class, of course, with two berths in a private cabin and a shared bathroom and shower. Second class cabins have four berths and share a bathroom with third class cabins. And third class cabins have six berths in open compartments. Bedding, pillows, blankets, as well as towels, soap, and other necessities are provided in each compartment. As you cross time zones, subtle shifts in light and air can be felt. It all adds to the excitement of the journey. You travel through a mountain tunnel as the sun sets, casting a warm glow over the horizon, and feel a refreshing breeze on your face. The sun warms your skin as you emerge on the other side. The train sounds from the clack of the tracks, and the distant rumble of the other trains passing by add to the experience. Outside, the aroma of pine trees and wildflowers mingle with that of freshly brewed coffee. The food on the train will vary depending on your ticket, your class, and destination. First-class passengers typically enjoy a three-course meal with a choice of entrees, while coach and sleeping car passengers have access to a restaurant car that sells hot meals, snacks, and beverages. The train's menu is frequently themed after regional cuisines. So expect to try Lake Baikal smoked fish and traditional Siberian dumplings called pelmeni, as well as hearty Russian dishes like borscht, stroganoff, and more. Crossing the 3,901 bridges that span everything from broad rivers to deep canyons is one of the most exciting parts of the journey. Each bridge is distinct. They all have their own style and feel. Anticipation grows with each approach. Some are long and very impressive, while others are very narrow and can only span a creek or a stream. Nonetheless, each one attests to the incredible engineering and human ingenuity of the Trans-Siberian Railway. As you near the end of your journey, you realize that this is more than just a train ride. You gained a new perspective on the world as a result of seeing, hearing, and smelling more of that beautiful countryside than you ever anticipated. These are interesting things with J.C.